Hello everyone, I'm doing a lesson today on what to do when your internet goes down and what internet hardware to check with when your internet goes down. So you're going to start by checking your modem and your router. Um, your modem will look a little something like that and your router like this. Um, if you can't tell the difference between the two, remember your router has the antenna. Unplug both of them from their power supply. If you have just a modem, unplug that and continue normally. Then plug them both in one at a time, starting with your modem. You'll see some lights come on on your modem. The most important lights to look for are the power, send, receive, and internet lights. If any of those lights are out, or maybe they're blinking, or maybe they're blinking with a red light or something, that usually means that there is some sort of issue with them. Anything but a steady green means that there's some sort of issue. So we're going to go and look at what each light means and how to help fix any of those problems. If the internet is light is out, disconnect all coaxial cable connections between the modem and the ha house. Then clean each connection well and then reconnect it and then try to unplug and replug in your modem and router like you did earlier. If you still have a problem, you're going to need to contact your ISP about what to do next. If the send or receive lights are out or blinking, well, generally send, that means you have a problem on your end. Try cleaning the connections like you did in the internet step. And if the receive light is out, this could mean that the internet is temporarily done or disconnected for everyone in your, on your ISP. Check with your ISP if you're completely unsure and you really need to know. Now your router lights are a little more tricky. If the wireless light is out, this usually means a hardware problem with your actual router and you could need a new router. If any other light is out, try reconnecting all the connections between the modem and the router, then unplug and replug in the modem and the router and wait for the lights to come on, starting with the modem and then the router. Um, I really hope this helped some people. Um, if it did, please promote me by rating me. Um, please check out my website where I've got more content like this. And thank you very much. I hope you enjoyed.